Hello there, people of YouTube land. This is Dodo Wrestling Fan, back for another exciting part of my playthrough of all the daytime stages from Sonic Unleashed. Hopefully the camera is lined up properly, and it is. So, yeah, let's begin. Today, we uh, do uh, Chunan and Rooftop Run, so this should be pretty exciting. As I am doing them in order. All right. I have to kind of get Chunan back to daytime. Of course, it was just turning nighttime, so I have to wait. But yes, this is China, I believe. Well, because what other place could it be other than China? This is also one of those very unique daytime stages. Um, because the daytime stages are all about just speed. That's pretty much the only thing that they're about. It may be a little platforming in a level, but this level has a lot of platforming in it. So, I haven't played this stage in a while, so hopefully I don't do too bad. Better go up there, get my extra life, even though it doesn't really matter, because I have 99 lives. This stage, though, is so high. Oh, I missed the speed booster. Oh, well. I missed that rail. Yeah, so I haven't played this stage in a while, so please forgive me if I do suck a bit. It's the one level I didn't practice on. But yes, I, I think the lighting effects in Sonic Unleashed... Yeah, usually boost there. But the lighting effects in Sonic Unleashed are so well done. The graphics are too in their own way. Go up there, go along the dragon. Neat path to take. Go up there, get my ten rings. Yeah, but maybe, like, graphically speaking, I think Unleash is a bit better than, um, Generations just because of the lighting, um, which is maybe why Sonic Generations PC people made the Unleash render. That's what I'm thinking, anyway. Grind these rails, and the first time that you go into this level, I died a lot. It's a harder daytime stage, one of the harder ones. But, I like it a lot, because of how cool it is. It's a cool level. Dragging a whole bunch of rings behind me. Make sure you hit these speed boosters, or else you're practically dead. Alright, let's see if I can take the upper path. Yes, I can today, grind on top of that rooftop. Making up for a sloppy beginning. Alright. Stop there. So, yeah. Um, this is the first time I've played Unleashed today. Because of, uh, I got a pickup yesterday of a Mario and Sonic at the 2012 Olympic Games. Which, by the way, if you haven't tried it, you should. It's a cheap game. I got it for five bucks. And it's really addicting, I must say. Boost up there, and yes, this is where this level will try to kill you. Stomp on him. Alright, jump over that. Now, I always get scared of the platforming in Sonic Unleashed, because the controls aren't fluent. Like generations are. Again, no point for me to go in there to get the extra life, but... I always flinch with every single tough platforming jump, like, ah, like, my arms literally tightened with that one. But luckily, the platforming in Sonic Unleashed is very thin. Yeah, I like the skydiving part here, it's cool. Dive down, get those rings. Alright, let's just avoid these, like, uh, I guess these missiles. I hate that guy. Okay. Oh. Oh. Oh, mama. Oh, mama. Oh, mama. Oh, I saved myself from death there. That had to be the most epic save from death ever. Actually, I, I think I'm doing pretty decent. I have about 489 rings right now, so... But I always seem to lose them here. This was a hard S rank for me to get. Alright, there's gonna be rings over here. And it's because of those things that kind of get in your way and smash and stuff. Because you can't see what angle he's going to do it at. Especially in the later part of this. So what, Sonic's running across the Great Wall of China? 
this part right here. Oh, somehow I made it today. I did it. All right. Oh, the speed. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, my goodness. That's fun. Another record. All right. So not my best time, but another score record. I've been doing pretty good so far. Level up Sonic the Shithog here, and let's get on our way to Rooftop Run, which is probably the one that most people have been waiting for. But yeah, that was China, and it's actually a pretty cool level, as you can see, like running across like dragons and stuff. It's a neat level. And this level is in the Wii version, and it actually has its own unique flavor in the Wii version. I'll give, I'll say that. Yeah, let's go to Rooftop Run, which is Italy. Or Spagonia, whatever you want to call it. So this should be actually one of the longest video so far of my Unleashed playthrough. It should be about over 10 minutes, I'd say. I don't know for sure, but I think it's going to be over 10 minutes. And I've asked YouTube, and I think I'm going to start uploading videos over 15 minutes. I don't know... If I can or not yet, but I have asked because out of bat and levels like that, um, they take a long time to complete. So yeah. All right, let's go under here. Now, even though this isn't my favorite daytime stage, it's still a blast to play through. But I'm glad that this got chosen for Sonic Unleash. I'm glad it did. Because I'm not Sonic Unleash, Sonic Generations, sorry. I always talk about Sonic Generations as being the most recent game, but in reality it's Sonic Lost World, and I have played it. Watch my true review of it if you haven't already seen it. Alright, quick step. Left, right, right. I've played this stage so many so many times I don't even need those icons to tell me. I wonder if there's a way I can shut those off. They're actually kind of annoying. Like, I know to boost through here. Hit those speed boosters. But the reason why a lot of people like this level is you've been in Spagonia for a long time. So when am I going to be able to play Rooftop Run? I played it as the Werehog, like, at the beginning of the game. So fork over my daytime stage. It doesn't come until... I think this is actually one of the more final daytime stages. Well, it is. It comes quite late in the game. So you're kind of antsy to get your hands on Rooftop Run. And this level does not disappoint. It is a fun, 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 boom level. I, I wish that Sonic could run at full speed during these chaser fights. I wish he could, but he can't. Oh, I missed my rings there, darn it. I'm having some frame rate issues, as you can see, so... That's something that the PS3 version has, and I think the 360 version has it as well. Hey, remake Sonic Unleashed for uh, PS4. Because I think Sonic Unleashed was overpowered, like not even the 360 or PS3 can handle this game, so... The Lightspeed Dash works in this game, which is a miracle. It's a gift sent from Jesus himself that the Lightspeed Dash works. All right, let's just have some random crates, you know, fall down on us. Let's hit those enemies, Sonic Boom style. Did, did you see that Sonic had no pupils? That was weird. That's what I noticed in the daytime stages in this game is Sonic has no pupils. Yeah, let's just not do that platforming section and just boost. The homing attack is actually really responsive in this game. Um, I've, I've also memorized this. I love the camera angle here. It's so cool. Sonic's grinding down the rail and you get to see all around the building. It's just so cool. These daytime stages are just so awesome. And that's the reason why Sonic Unleashed is my fifth favorite Sonic game. Sonic CD beats it out. Which, by the way, that's something that I may have to do sometime. Um, 
leave me a comment if you want to see me do some top 10 lists. I have a computer so I can try my hand at editing. Got a moon medal, but again, doesn't really matter anymore. So here we go. This is the finale of Rooftop Run, the final part. I really wish Tom could run at full speed, though, but he can't. Alright, go over here. Go over here. Go over here. Go over here. Alright. That one's gonna start doing it to us. Alright. much to say except my sensor bar just fell down from my Wii. But I'm just kind of in the zone right now, so mind me if my commentary isn't too witty. But I know that there's a DLC DLC stage for Empire City where you get to do these fights at full speed. It's crazy. I mean, I might want to show it off. Because I do have the DLC for this game. But yes, we come out at a nice mighty 4 minutes 32 seconds. I think that's a new record, isn't it? Yeah, new time record, alright. And I got myself yet another S rank. I am on fire with my Sonic Unleashed daytime playthrough. And it's nice to see that I'm not sucking. Uh, also, leave me a comment if you want to see me redo my SA2 playthrough, because my video quality is substantially better now, and my tablet couldn't keep up with the gameplay, so leave, drop me a comment there if you want to see that. I'm thinking about doing it. But, yeah, this has been Dodo Wrestling Fan with Part 3 of his Sonic Unleashed Daytime Stages playthrough. And I've said, leave a comment, like, and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. This is Dodo Wrestling Fan, signing out.